Antarctica, a land of extremes where the environment is as harsh as it is beautiful, a place of breathtaking beauty and unforgiving cold where temperatures can plummet to unimaginable lows. This icy expanse shrouded in mystery has captivated explorers and adventurers for centuries, drawing them into its frozen embrace. Imagine a vast white desert stretching as far as the eye can see, an endless expanse of ice and snow. The only sounds are the howling wind and the crunching of snow beneath your boots, a symphony of solitude. Towering icebergs, sculpted by the relentless forces of nature, stand like silent sentinels, guardians of this frozen world. This is Antarctica, the last true wilderness on Earth, untouched and untamed by human hands. The air is crisp and clear, carrying the faint scent of salt from the southern ocean, a reminder of the life that thrives beneath the ice. The sun, low on the horizon, casts long shadows across the ice, painting a picture of stark beauty. It's a world of stark contrasts, where life clings tenaciously to existence, defying the odds in this frozen frontier. Penguins waddle along the icy shores, their movements a comical yet determined dance, while seals bask in the brief warmth of the sun, savoring every moment. Beneath the surface of the frigid waters a vibrant ecosystem teems with life, a hidden world of wonder and resilience. But Antarctica holds secrets. Mysteries that have puzzled scientists and explorers for generations, challenging our understanding of this remote land. Deep within its frozen heart, hidden beneath layers of ice and snow, lie clues to the past waiting to be discovered. Clues that challenge our understanding of history and hint at the possibility of lost civilizations buried beneath the ice. And in one remote corner of this frozen continent, a discovery was made that sent shockwaves through the scientific community, altering our perception of Antarctica forever. A discovery that raised more questions than answers, sparking debates and further exploration. A discovery that whispered of a time before the ice, a time when Antarctica may have been a very different place, teeming with life and mystery. Rumors had been circulating for years, whispers among explorers and researchers of a strange anomaly in a remote region of Antarctica, a region known for its extreme weather conditions and treacherous terrain, a place few dared to venture. The rumors spoke of a cave, hidden within a mountain range, a cave with something unusual at its entrance, stairs. At first the stories were dismissed as mere folklore, tales spun by lonely explorers eager for a good story, but the whispers persisted, fueled by blurry photographs and anecdotal accounts. Some spoke of ancient carvings on the cave walls, while others claimed to have seen strange lights emanating from within. The stories varied, but one detail remained consistent, the stairs. The scientific community remained skeptical. Without concrete evidence, the rumors were nothing more than intriguing speculation. But for a select few, the whispers were too compelling to ignore. They yearned to uncover the truth behind the legend, to separate fact from fiction. And so an expedition was mounted. A team of experienced explorers, scientists and researchers, armed with the latest technology and driven by an unquenchable thirst for knowledge, set out to investigate the rumors, their destination, the remote, desolate region where the cave was said to exist, their mission to find the truth. The journey was fraught with challenges, each step more daunting than the last. The team battled against relentless blizzards, navigated treacherous crevasses that seemed to open up beneath their feet, and endured temperatures that could freeze flesh in an instant, making every breath a struggle. But they pressed on, their determination fueled by the allure of the unknown, the promise of uncovering secrets long buried by ice and time. After weeks of arduous travel, battling the elements and their own fatigue, they finally reached their destination. There, nestled amidst the towering peaks and glaciers, was the cave, a dark maw in the icy landscape. The entrance, partially obscured by ice and snow, was indeed man-made, hinting at a forgotten past. A crude archway carved into the rock face led into the darkness, inviting yet foreboding, and there, leading up into the shadows, were the stairs, beckoning them to explore further. They were ancient, weathered by time and the elements but unmistakably stairs, crafted by hands long gone. The team exchanged excited glances, their hearts pounding with anticipation and curiosity. This was no mere natural formation, it was a testament to human ingenuity, or perhaps something even older. This was something else entirely. Cautiously they stepped inside, their senses heightened. The air was cold and damp, heavy with the smell of earth and something indefinable, a scent that spoke of ancient secrets. 
the light from their headlamps danced across the rough-hewn walls, revealing more stairs that spiraled upwards into the darkness, leading them deeper into the unknown. Excitement mingled with apprehension as they ascended, each step echoing in the silence. Each step seemed to take them further back in time, deeper into the heart of the mystery, as if they were walking through history itself. What secrets did this cave hold? What stories were etched into its walls? Who built these stairs and for what purpose? The questions swirled in their minds, the questions hung heavy in the air as the team ventured deeper into the unknown, their resolve unwavering. The discovery had the potential to rewrite history, to challenge everything they thought they knew about Antarctica, and perhaps even the world itself. Section 4. Initial Reactions, Bewilderment and Speculation The discovery of the cave and its enigmatic stairs sent ripples of astonishment and disbelief across the globe. People from all walks of life were captivated by the mystery that seemed to defy explanation. The initial images beamed back to civilization by the expedition team's satellite link sparked intense debate and speculation. Experts and amateurs alike poured over the photos, each trying to make sense of what they were seeing. News outlets around the world clamored for information, eager to be the first to break the story. Reporters worked around the clock, piecing together any scraps of information they could find. Social media platforms erupted with theories ranging from the plausible to the wildly imaginative. Hashtags related to the cave trended globally as people shared their thoughts and speculations. Some speculated that the stairs were remnants of an ancient civilization, a lost chapter in human history. This theory gained traction among those fascinated by the idea of hidden histories and forgotten peoples. Others suggested the cave might be a natural phenomenon, a bizarre quirk of geology. Geologists debated whether such formations could occur naturally, given the unique conditions of Antarctica. The scientific community, initially skeptical, was forced to confront the undeniable evidence. The clarity and precision of the images left little room for doubt. Geologists puzzled over the composition of the cave and the stairs, while archaeologists scoured historical records for any mention of structures in the region. The search for clues became a race against time. The discovery challenged conventional wisdom, forcing experts to re-examine long-held beliefs about Antarctica's past. Heated debates ensued with some proposing radical new theories. The expedition team, meanwhile, continued their exploration of the cave. Each new discovery added another layer to the enigma. Each step they took, each new chamber they discovered, only deepened the mystery. The cave seemed to stretch endlessly, with each turn revealing more questions than answers. The answers they sought seemed tantalizingly close, yet remained frustratingly out of reach. The deeper they went, the more elusive the truth became. The world watched and waited, eager for answers, hungry for knowledge. The anticipation was palpable as everyone hoped for a breakthrough. The stairs had awakened something primal in the human psyche, a yearning to understand our past and our place in the universe. This discovery had the potential to reshape our understanding of history and humanity itself. Section 5. The Historical Lens, Exploring Past Expeditions The discovery of the stairs ignited a renewed interest in the history of Antarctic exploration. Scholars and historians delved into archives, poring over dusty journals and expedition logs. They searched for any mention of unusual structures, any hint that someone might have visited this remote region before. Their research led them to the accounts of early explorers like James Cook and Ernest Shackleton. These intrepid adventurers had braved treacherous seas and unforgiving conditions to chart the unknown continent. While their journals made no mention of caves with stairs, they did describe the awe-inspiring power of nature and the challenges of navigating the icy wilderness. Further investigation unearthed intriguing references to ancient maps, allegedly drawn by long-lost civilizations. These maps, if authentic, depicted Antarctica with astonishing accuracy, including details that were only recently confirmed by modern technology. Some of these maps hinted at the existence of rivers, mountains, and even cities beneath the ice. Could these maps hold the key to understanding the stairs? Was it possible that a civilization now lost to time, once flourished in Antarctica? The historical evidence, while fragmentary, provided tantalizing clues but no definitive answers. The mystery of the stairs deepened. Section 6. Natural Formations or Man-Made Marvel The debate raged on. Were the stairs a natural formation, a bizarre quirk of geology? 
or were they evidence of something more extraordinary, something that defied conventional explanations? Geologists studying the images and samples brought back by the expedition team were divided. Some argued that the stairs could be the result of a rare form of erosion, where wind, ice, and water had sculpted the rock into these intriguing shapes over millennia. They pointed to examples of other natural formations around the world that resembled man-made structures, such as the Giant's Causeway in Northern Ireland, or the Wave in Arizona. These geological wonders, while impressive, were undoubtedly the product of natural forces. However, other geologists were not convinced. The regularity of the stairs, their consistent size and spacing, suggested something more deliberate, more purposeful. The composition of the rock also raised questions. It appeared to be a type not found naturally in the immediate vicinity, suggesting the stairs might have been constructed using materials transported from elsewhere. The debate between natural formation and man-made marvel continued, each side presenting compelling arguments. The answer, it seemed, lay somewhere in the heart of the mountain, hidden within the secrets of the cave.